Hey guys, thanks for tuning into the channel for another weekly Dollar Tree haul, which is what I have before me to share with you guys in a minute. But before then, I like to ask, you might want to consider hitting that subscribe button so that you can join the family. I'd love to have you. It's absolutely free. Oh, and go on ahead and smash that little icon notification bell so that YouTube may notify you each and every time I upload new content. Now with all of that said and done and out the way, let's get right on into this haul. So as you see before me, I have my little haul that I'm about to share with you neatly contained in the contents of my little dish pen just to keep it all together, but it's in no particular order. So I'm going to give it a little spin around so that we can just grab at the bigger items. And um, I just want to say that I went into the Dollar Tree this time around looking for some of the uh, Easter and spring decor. And that was a big fail because my Dollar Trees are really behind in the game as far as getting their deliveries and shipments in. So I was a little bummed about that. But I did manage to come out with a few things. Now this is a repeat purchase. I purchased it last year when it came around. And and so this time I, when I saw it again, I knew immediately I had to snatch it up while I still had the chance because these go really quickly. And this is the Salon Selective's Marula Magic. And this is the shampoo and conditioner set. And what it says here is that it's low fiable, it's uh, paraben free, color protecting, and enriched with vitamin E. So what more can you ask for for a buck? And the packaging alone, guys, look at these pumps, these easy, convenient pumps for a dollar, come on. And so I saw these and I knew that I had to grab them, but then also, uh, right next to them were these Daily Defense body washes. I thought they were shampoo and conditioner as well. Those are Salon Selective. These are Daily Defense. And this one is in the Ocean Minerals with Sea Kelp Extract. And then this one is um, Jojoba Oil. And um, it says Fresh Essence with jojoba oil and i smelled them guys while i was in the store and they smell amazing this one smells it has like a little floral rosy kind of scent if you're into that and this one just has a fresh clean like an ocean mist and so for a buck also with the pump i thought that was convenient also, another repeat purchase item are the Acetam Assured Acetaminophen, and these are the 500 milligrams. They come with 40 caplets per pack, and these are comparable to the uh, Extra Strength Tylenol, and I buy these all the time, and as a matter of fact, I like them better than the Extra Strength Tylenol, to tell you. The last couple of times that I went to the Dollar Tree, I wasn't able to find the Mr. Clean brand uh, magic eraser and I was holding the umbrella one which is just this good but um, this time around I managed to find the name brand so I picked up two then this guys was absolutely a new find I have never seen this before in any of my Dollar Trees and it's called an all-in-one home office kit look at the size of this box I could barely get it in the shot and it says here Okay, all the stuff that it contains. All-in-one office kit contains ultra sharp stainless steel eight and a half inch scissor, stainless steel staple remover, stainless steel light duty blade, extra long smooth gliding letter opener, 25 push pins, 70 paper clips, and a bonus roll of adhesive tape all in this box for a dollar guy you know what let's open it and see if it really does have all of yes look at all of this stuff guys that you're getting in here for a dollar the scissors the knife the stapler remover the push pin this is cool for like um somebody that has a home office or even if you want to take it to work 
or just to you know replenish some of your um, items for a dollar as opposed to buying them separately yes please I love it so I took it home um, also I'm a sucker for magnets so I update Dollar Tree gets me all the time I fell in love with this one that says never trust a skinny chef I think that's so true and it also caught my eye because of the farmhouse inspired detail with the kind of like faux ship lappy wood paneling and this one matches with it it just says chef in the house and so they're both magnets and I had to pick them up okay picked up some of these Remington uh, hair ties they say hair and wrists because you know a lot of the young girls they like to wear these around their wrists as fashion bracelets or whatever but I really like these because they they're kind of silky and smooth and they don't pull the hair so I picked up a pack of those and because I wasn't able to find any of the Easter decor items I just got snagged into the impulse section right around when I was going to check out First of all, I picked up some sugar-free gum. I got the um, four pack of the extra peppermint and the 20 pieces of Trident. And then I also got uh, this pack of Icebreakers Ice Cube and the Arctic Grape. And while I was there in that section, I found some of these um, luggage tag. Look at these luggage tags, guys. They're like a rose gold. And then this one has like a green rose gold and silver uh, metallic mixed together. And these, they, they're supposed to be luggage tags. And they just have the clear strap that you can put around your luggage. But you can use these on backpacks, um, whatever you want to label to you know make sure that it doesn't get lost and so i just had to pick them up for the shiny bling factor um i also found these jewels and gems that i had never seen before in dollar tree and so i picked up two packs of the round and they have kind of that holographic aesthetic to them it's that and then I picked up the um, corresponding uh, star one. These are little stars in different sizes, and they also have kind of that, uh, you know, rainbowy metallic holographic effects. So I picked those up. And speaking of holographic with those colors, I also found this pineapple, and I was like, ta-da! I had held the little ring holder in the past, which is also a pineapple, and it's like this small and round, and so now, I guess they're, that's kind of like a thing, because they also had the um, eyelash curler, the um, tweezers, all with this same kind of pattern, so I just had to pick up this pineapple picked up some burlap just to because I was running low on it and I needed to pick up another one um, I picked up one of these um, lip glosses and it's just like a little diamond shape and that really nice green color and this one is watermelon scented they had um, other scents and flavors but I just needed the one and I also stumbled across this little novelty ball and it's kind of like a dress ball and it has these little orbs in it those little orbies and you can squeeze it so I picked that up because I have an idea in mind for that and last but not least were these three snacks that I picked up I grabbed some of the um Russell Stover's sugar-free dark chocolate uh mint I've bought these before and they're wonderful they taste just like the Thin Mints, if you know, you're know you having that kind of sweet tooth but and you want to indulge but not really um, go over the top with the sugar and stuff, this is good. And then this one is the uh, Caramel Russell Stovers. I've never had this one before and I was curious about it. So I thought I'd give it a shot. And also um, I found some of these... Uh, almonds these roasted salted almonds these are two grams of net carbs per serving and they're two servings 
per pack. So I thought that was good. Also, I'm sorry, guys. I thought these were the last items, but um, apparently I had some other things sneaking off to the side. I picked up some nail files. I found one pack of the Sassy and Chic Emery boards, and they come with these two in the pack with the star pattern on it and then also right next to them i found these little travel um sassy and chic nail files which i thought were so cute for backpacks and purses and just little nail kits and what have you because they come with the uh, nail fashion nail file and then they have a little travel case that also has one inside already so you're getting two for the price of one a backup and you're getting Getting the um, kit. So that's all for my haul, guys. That was it for this week's finds. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. I hope you seen something that might have inspired you to want to go out and check your Dollar Tree. And uh, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like these kind of hauls. And as always, I'll meet you back here in my next Dollar Tree haul. Talk to you soon. Bye, guys.